all paper was made by hand, much as we are doing it now, from its invention 500 years before Christ through to the invention of the machine in 1800. But we're not attempting in any way to be a working museum to maintain old methods. So there are adaptations here. We use modern sizing techniques. You'll notice downstairs we use vacuum alongside the making vat. We cooch onto hard felt, which is not traditional. So we've adapted, or I've adapted it, so that we can do a better job quicker. The paper we make is what I call gallery paper, so virtually all of this paper will end up hanging it on a wall or stuck in some artist's portfolio. We make paper for artists and for designers. What's most satisfying about this job, in truth, is actually, is actually to see the finished work that the artists produce on it. So to go to an exhibition and see the work on the wall is quite nice. And it's even better, I think, really, to have a customer come back with us by email, social media, and say, look what I've done. And you say, wow, that's, that's something a bit special. But it's a business. I like to see a good job on the bench. And even better, I like to see the payment come through because that's what keeps us all in bacon. <laughs>